Welcome back to another quick tip. In this video, I'll show you three different techniques in Keyshot for creating some awesome glowing buttons like these. For the first two techniques, you'll need to do some prep work in your CAD software. Split the surfaces you would like to illuminate and make sure the bottom of the geometry is open in order to create a backsplash of light. To get the best effect in Keyshot, make sure to check global illumination and enable the bloom effect in the image tab. Now let's look to this button first. Like I said, this technique will require some prep work in your CAD software. We'll be using a physical light, which is why this option has the potential to be the most realistic. First, you'll need to change the material of the part you want light to emit through. Go for something like a transparent or cloudy plastic, and expect to have to tweak the settings like the transparency distance, which I had to bring down quite a bit. Then go to Edit, Add Geometry, and bring in a cube. This will be our light source. Move it just under the surface of your button, and then switch the material to a point light. An area light or emissive material can work too, depending on your scene. I'll change the color first, then bring the power down a bit and the radius up to give it a softer shadow. This is a great option because you'll see some light spilling out around the edge as well as coming through the top surface. For the second technique, you still do need to separate the surface in your CAD software, but you won't need to use geometry as a physical light source. Instead, just change the material of this part to emissive. Adjust the color and intensity to your liking maybe add a texture, and really that's about it. This is a super quick and effective option. Lastly, on this button, we're going to create that glow by applying an emissive label to the material. This is nice because you don't need to split any surfaces in your CAD software. I'll double click the part to bring up the material, then switch to the labels tab and drag in my image. Adjust the label as you need, and then change the label type to emissive. To increase the brightness, switch to the Label Properties tab and adjust the Intensity slider. With Bloom enabled, this gives a great effect with hardly any setup. So those are the basics of three very helpful techniques for glowing buttons and illuminating surfaces that you can employ across a wide variety of Keyshot scenes. Let us know your favorite. Thanks for watching this Keyshot Quick Tip. Leave a comment below with your thoughts and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful content. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and share it with your friends.